All extrusion processes require the plastic to flow. If you extrude plastics, you should understand how flow can affect the process. Plastic inside the extruder and die is subjected to heat and pressure. When plastic is heated, like almost all materials, it expands. Each molecule moves further away from its neighbors. Heating a plastic to its processing temperature moves the molecules far enough apart so that when pressure is applied, the plastic will flow. To demonstrate the basic characteristics of plastic flow, we'll imagine heated plastic in a pipe, much like the flow passage in a dye. This pipe contains polymer molecules. Let's cut the pipe in half and see how the plastic flows. We'll make the plastic flow by applying pressure. The velocity of each molecule depends on where it is located across the flow passage. The arrows show this relative speed. The molecules near the wall of the flow passage flow more slowly than those molecules in the center of the flow stream. This happens because there is friction between these molecules and the wall of the flow passage. This friction slows down their flow speed or velocity. If we connect these arrows, the result is a velocity profile of this flow stream. The speed of each molecule depends on how far it is from the wall. The fastest molecules are in the center.